Cage Aggression 19 Clash of Champions continues making his way to the Cage Aggression Octagon is Jacob Horry, six feet, 170 pounds, fighting out of Quincy, Illinois, and he is listed as an independent fighter. Said that he had a really good camp and had been working on a lot of his jujitsu ahead of time, so he was looking to sharpen those skills. I always wonder when, when guys sort of say that they want to work on one specific discipline as far as mixed martial arts is concerned. If you are a Cage Aggression fan, you hear that music come on and you know exactly who it is walking down to the octagon. <laughs> Jeremy Angry Anderson, six foot two, 170 pounds, fighting out of Davenport, Iowa. Definitely not a stranger to the Cage Aggression octagon. So um, what do you guys think we can expect from Jeremy tonight? Uh, an overhand right, man. You know, he likes to throw them <laughs> overhands. He's got, he's got power in those hands, though, man. So let's see. Uh, I don't know too much about uh, his opponent, but I know Jeremy's going to come in and he's going to be looking for the knockout. Yeah, uh, one of his last times that he came into the cage digression cage, he fought uh, John Kennedy. He's never, I don't think, has ever been knocked out or TKO'd or anything along those lines. And Jeremy Anderson put a bomb on him that... Uh, that definitely did that for him and starched him up real good that night. So he's definitely got very, very incredible knockout power in his hand, and uh, he's probably going to look to put put one of those bombs on Jacob Corey's chin. Yep. Yeah, he's one of those guys that, you know, you, a lot of times you hear guys with nicknames and you be like, huh, I don't really understand how this guy gets that nickname. But when you, when you know Jeremy a little bit, and I, I know him a little bit, he doesn't strike me as an angry person, but once he walks into that octagon, there is nothing but anger that comes exactly. out of those fists. <laughs> yeah, he looks like an angry man walking out on that on that platform, man. He, he comes out and he's, he's trying to get it done. Mistaken, Jeremy, this is a rematch, isn't it? You know what? I'm not exactly sure. You know, I'm not sure. Um, I think it is. Yeah, I think it is. I think it is too. Yep. And I, if I'm not mistaken as well, I know Jeremy Anderson's last fight was a loss that he took in a rematch to uh, to Mr. Kennedy. So um, I know he's coming in with a lot of uh, extra anger tonight, probably. Ladies and gentlemen, this bout is scheduled for three five-minute rounds in the Cage Aggression Professional Division. Introducing first, fighting out of the red corner. He stands at even six feet tall and weighed in at 173 and one half pounds. Joining us from Quincy, Illinois, Jacob Corey. And his opponent, fighting out of the blue corner. He stands six feet, two inches tall, and weighed in at 181 pounds. He's sponsored by Nyquist Roundhouse Martial Arts, Caged Aggression Apparel, Brandon Adamson Striking, Muay Thai, and MMAO, and Discount Furniture of Rock Island. Joining us from Davenport, Illinois, Jeremy Angry Anderson! Jacob Corey in the red corner, Jeremy Angry Anderson in the blue corner. Your referee for this matchup is Bruce Allen. Jeremy J.D. Dorsey here tonight on commentary along with Eric Showtime Shelton and Jordan the Henchman Henman. Let's watch some fights. Yeah, um, after looking back, Jeremy Anderson fought Jacob Corey for the, um, the, the Road to Sturgis show for Cage Aggression ah. on the Challenger 3 Series. Okay. And uh, Jeremy won that fight with a, with a TKO victory in the first round. And uh, looking at, at Jacob Corey's record, he's fought a couple tough guys, one being uh, Ricardo Lamas and another being a cat named Dustin Neese. I don't know if it, anybody knows that. that overhand right I was telling you about. He's looking for it. These guys are taking no time. They're trading. Both guys swinging for the fences, man. 
you know, feeling each other out with the rematch. They already oh, know no, what each oh, other no. have. And a good elbow by Corey in the clinch. You don't see that a whole lot. Guys using those short strikes and the short distances. Oh, yeah. That was nice. Yeah, Anderson really loading up that right hand. Corey's out here looking like he's got something to prove. He's got a little chip on his shoulder. Good Ooh, knee and then a good right, right by Corey. It's like Corey is dead. Yeah, I'm not sure what happened. Oh, huge oh, knee right there. Another a body by Anderson. And he's looking to finish Jacob Corey here in the first round. Oh, yeah. And I know this is not what Corey's wanting after their last meeting. This is kind of how it took place. Yep. Big shots there by Anderson. Yeah, and I don't think this is going to go too much longer. He's just pounding on him, and there you have your stoppage. Quick, quick, quick victory there by Jeremy Angry Anderson. Yeah, those guys came out to, to do bad intentions to one another. <laughs> oh, yeah, big time. I'm not sure what had happened in that ex exchange, but it looked like Jake and Corey got the better of Jeremy Anderson, yeah. and then he kind of stumbled back, right? Yeah, like, yeah. I, I would like to see a replay on that and see if he, uh, if Anderson caught him with something in that clinch that we didn't see, but nonetheless. Those are the ones that do it. Yeah, <laughs> nonetheless, a, a great performance by Jeremy Anderson tonight to weather the storm of Jacob Corey and put him away in the first round. It looks like the great guys over at Mind Print Productions are giving us a nice replay right here, right now. The finish, maybe they can run it back a little bit and we can see a little bit more of that sort of stagger. Yeah, it looked like Corey landed a shot, yeah, but he, he also must have took one at that same exact time. He landed a knee and then a, a and then a big hook uh, on the break and then he kind of stayed here. And here it is, we're going back to it. Body shot. There's the knee, wow. there's the punch, and then... Oh, that little jab right there. Was that what it was? Was the, ja was oh, the jab? Oh, the uppercut right there. Yeah, it was the uppercut. Okay, yeah, wow. he caught him on the uppercut wow. on the way off the cage. Good now, job. Ladies and gentlemen, Anderson. your referee, Bruce Allen, has called a stop to this it's contest crazy. at one minute, 25 seconds into round one, declaring your winner by TKO, Jeremy Angry Anderson. Come on, buddy. All right, ladies and gentlemen. I'm here with the winner, Jeremy Anderson. We got the camera over here, baby. A one like that one, I have to say, I'm pretty sure I think you did Iowa proud by that one. <laughs> well, I mean, he's a tough guy. The first time, first time we fought, we came out and did the same damn thing. So I wasn't expecting any less. Uh, he likes to throw hard punches, and sorry for the sloppiness on my part. I kind of get caught up in that. When he starts swinging them, I start fucking slinging them. So I, so I apologize for that. It was sloppy, but hey, it was fun to watch, I hope. It was definitely fun to watch. Now, you know how this sport goes. You blink, you miss. And I just so happened to be looking down, taking some notes. And I looked up, and, and it looked like he got stung or something real quick. What, what happened there? Me? Yeah. yeah, he caught me with, uh, I think it was an overhand right. And then uh, I saw it, and then I caught him over here with a straight right. I could tell he's hurt, so fuck, man. I'm, that's why a guy gets that case right, beat the shit out of him. So, uh, you know, it's, I love this sport, man. I love you guys for coming out here, putting, putting up with us fighters. Uh, I appreciate everything. I enjoy being here. I'm 38 years old. I'm getting old as hell. I don't know how much longer I'm going to do this at all. So thank you for being here. Thank you for being a part of this with me, everybody that comes to support me. I love you and I appreciate it. Uh, I, made a, I made a promise to somebody that I would call out one person. And uh, he was a UFC vet. And he asked, he's, we were talking, we've had, he's kicked my ass in the, in, the, in the gym for years, for years. I just want to see what we can do. So Drew McFedders, we can have a little fun, just at 70 pounds. He said he dropped to 70. We can have a little fun, you kick my ass. I'd like to get at least a couple punches in on you. We'll have fun with it. Well, I think that'd be a fun one to have right here at Cage Aggression. We're good friends, but we, he's kicked the shit out of me for years, so I can try to, to return the favor a little bit, you know. What do you say, River Center? All right, well, now that we got that warmed up, Jeremy, is there anything you want to say before you get back, bud? No, uh, thank you for everybody coming. My daughter Lala at home, I love you more than anything. Here with the reason I do everything in my life. Without you, I'd be nothing. Without you, I probably wouldn't be here. So thank you and all the fans and all the, everybody here to support us. Thank you very much. Uh, we really appreciate it. It's us that owes you the thanks. Thanks, Jeremy. Your winner, Jeremy Angry Anderson, ladies and gentlemen.